Good afternoon everyone and Salamat Sore. For today's video we drove all the way to Kuta to a room which is called Nikmat. I never heard of it before but we got this suggested so many times. It is a Javanese restaurant and it looks like this. Warum Java, that's how you call it. And we are going to try food from Java. I'm super excited and I'm going to take you guys along with this journey. This is the room. From the outside it looks like this. This is where we're gonna eat and it's quite big. It's bigger than I thought it would be. Here you see all the people eating and it's located in this small street. As you can see it's rainy season so there's lots of water. It's super super wet. Rainy season has officially started here in Bali and we were driving through the rain actually to get here. So for today's video we have William. What up? How are you today? Pretty good. Are you excited to try yeah, some I Javanese food? I didn't eat at all today, so oh, I'm starving. You're hungry? Yeah. Okay, that is perfect. So we have Will and we have, as always, Yoshino again. <laughs> Just found out that Nikmat means delicious in the slang that they have here. So it's actually called Warung Delicious Food. So that's actually super interesting. So for me, this is gonna be the first time that I ever eat Japanese food. But what about you, Will? Is this your first time or? I never had some. You never? Oh my God, this is gonna be super exciting. First time for the both of us, Japanese food. Really curious what we're gonna think of it. It's time to order now. It is looking so delicious. I will show you how it looks like now. I am already so in love with how this food looks like. It is amazing. There's also so much choice. So I'm gonna ask for me to choose because there's too much for me to try at once. So I'm just gonna have recommended what I need to try. That one? Yeah. Two. Uh, this is all, all, all super this typical. Is... <laughs> that's the Ethan award. Yeah. Oh, that's Dutch. I love that. That's the Ethan. Like it means that. best <laughs> dinner award. Oh, that's so nice. We already have a lot. And this sambal. is all for us. Yes, let's add okay. sambal. Sambal. Let's just try it. <laughs> so this is what we're gonna get. Yay! We are done ordering. They're gonna bring it now to the table. So it's time to sit down and we ordered so much food because Will was hungry. So we ordered a lot. Makasi! We have everything. This is how it looks like. There is so much. This is lalapan. I never had it before. We're gonna try, I think let's start with the parkadel. Yeah. Yeah. That what is it? Parkadel. It's no, like I... potato fritter. Oh, okay. We are gonna start today with parkadel. I had this before, but it was parkadel padang food. So now it's from Java. So it looks like this. I am so excited because I'm also really hungry. Let's see. Oh, that's good. Right? That's really good. Mm, I love this taste. This is how it looks like from the inside. It's really soft and I would say... It's quite sweet too. Honestly. Yeah, it's sweet as well, yeah. right? Soft and sweet. The flavor is not too strong, but it is amazing. What would you give it? Mm, honestly, I like it really. Oh, like a lot. I would say 9 out of 10. You too? Yeah. 9 out of 10 it is for Parkadel. It's just because it's so soft. It's a little bit of kids' food as well. I think is it? Kids will, yeah, kids love it's this. It's really good. Uh -huh. I still don't know what... I think what I should say with the veggies there. This one first because that looks better. So this is bunches and wortel. That's the same as in Dutch actually. In Dutch I would say bunches and wortel. So it's not that big of a difference. In English you just say veggies. Yeah. <laughs> Very simple. Yeah. Let's try some bunches and wortel. It just looks like this, it's super simple actually. But it's like carrot and beans. Yeah. But there's a, mm, see? There's like a certain flavor to it. It's a little bit spicy. 
Yeah, because of the chilies. Yeah, it's nice. Um, this is a really nice dish. It's really good. It's like it's, simple. Yeah, it's it's simple. That's the thing. So it's like a seven out of ten. I would eat this. It's also healthy. I feel like it's kind of okay, but it's not too special. <laughs> no, I mean it's veggies, you know. So next up in line is called pare. We both have no idea what it is. I, will, I mean, there's garlic in there. I'll put a picture that. here what pare is because I still don't know. I'm just gonna go with flow. It's supposed to be bitter. So there's a lot of garlic. I don't know if you can see it. This is four pieces of garlic in here. So let's see. Oh, and so tempeh. To be bitter? There's also tempeh in here. Yeah. Oh, yeah, there. And chili. Let's see. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. Not my thing. I mean, it's not disgusting, but it's not like. Good thing there were chili in there, honestly. Oh, I really didn't like this. This is um, very strong. What is this? Is there like seaweed in here? Look at this. It looks like this. I don't know. It has it's a weird. really strong flavor. Yeah, it's weird. Oh, I taste it like a lot still now. Eat the chili. Taste will be gone. What will you give it? This is for me a 3 3.5, of... maybe. Yeah. Five, like 4, maybe. Like, it's not disgusting, but it's not good either. I really don't like this. No. Oh, no. Parle? What was it? Okay, not for me. Next up, beef rendang. My favorite food in the whole world. <laughs> um, beef rendang. Beef rendang. You need to eat beef rendang with nasi, because otherwise it's not the right taste and combination. I learned that. So you mix yes. it, right? Yes, you need to mix it. Very important. Beef rendang mixed I'll with nasi. That. Let's see, I had really good beef rendang with when I was trying padang food, so I'm not sure if this can live up to it. This is how it looks like now. I'm gonna take my first bite. Really excited for this one. Mm. Ooh. Looks spicy, there's a lot of chili in there. Wow. Like a lot. Oh, you're gonna love this. Mm. Oh, like it? Yes, please taste. You'll fall in love with it too. Wow, this taste, whew, this is so good. That's really good. Oh yeah, yep. you like it? Mm. I'm sorry, I just need to try it like this. It's so nice, wow. It has even like some... It's not spicy at all. No, it's, it's not spicy, spicy and the spicy. beef is cooked so good. It's so tender. You just like fall apart because that's yeah. not like tender. The beef falls apart yeah. perfectly and the taste it's just spicy enough. There's even like a little like fresh touch to it. I don't know what kind of flavor it is. I would say this is just as good as the beef rendang I had with padang food. It's a 9.5. We'll give that a 9. We'll give that a 9. Why a 9? Yeah. I mean, that's really good, but that's not a 10. I love it. Next up, we have ikan tuna balado, which is like tuna fish, but that balado means it's spicy. So it's probably it very spicy. <laughs> looks so spicy. Let me show you. You can see how much chili is on there. It's insane. And I see like even the fish bowl. Yeah, yeah, that's why I was called. like, that's literally fish. Yeah. Because you can so see them like. Here, you need I don't to know be... if you can see it, but like, yeah. Oh yeah, I see. see like fish bones there. You need to be very careful with this one. I'm going for my first bite. I added, again, a lot of chili. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Mmm, ooh, ooh. I like this. It is spicy, and it's a little bit spicy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm to a little stay bit, strong. she's literally dying. I was like, it's not spicy, I'll try to stay strong. Yeah, it is. It is a little bit too spicy for me, but the taste is really nice, right? Yeah. Uh, what's going on? I have like a chili pepper in my throat. <coughs> Whew. The flavor is nice because they added tomato to the sambal, so that makes it less spicy. That's what I was also thinking, like the spiciness takes away the flavor of the fish. So I would give this one six out of 10. You? Seven point five. I like it. Ooh, okay. We have chicken. Hello? Bacon. I got it too. <laughs> That's again Dutch. What's going on? <laughs> What did you say? Regen means rain in English. And I just heard two locals saying that to each other. So I was like, ah. Next up in line, we have chicken turmeric curry. I never had chicken. But what's the real name? What is it? Chicken turmeric curry. I don't know what's it about. What's the name of this? Do you know? I am curry. So it looks very spicy. I don't even know how to try this. There's so much skin. I don't want to have the chicken skin though. No? No. I want to have a lot of sauce though. You want to die. It looks like this. It smells very good. Oh, wow. It's not spicy. No, not spicy at all. Oh, wow, this is amazing. Next bite. Wow. 
I love how tender the chicken is, yes, how soft. It's like it's really soft cooked chicken. And the flavor is amazing. It's really curry flavor, but a soft curry flavor. Like I wouldn't say it's too strong, right? It's really, really nice. This is for me 0.5 less than Rendang. So I give this 9 out of 10. That's how I'm, how much I love it. For me, it's like quite equal. Equal? With the Ooh. With beef. Mmm. Mmm. it right. Even better. Is it? It is. Ooh. Yeah, it's just perfect. Even this, adding it with rice makes it so much better. Mm. Yes. It is so good. I just want to only eat the sauce with rice and now I'm like... There was so much water that came with that. You have no idea. Oh my god. <laughs> Because I love the beef rendang so much. It's my favorite food in Bali. I just ordered one more and I'm not even done with the whole food tasting. <laughs> oh, beef rendang is just the best thing ever. So we have this one here, beef with soy sauce. So I and think ketchup. Beef, beef. soy sauce and ketchup? Yeah. It's quite hard. Huh? It's hard. I thought it was softer. Then this one it looks like. Wow. Ooh. Mm. Okay. That was my first bite, so it's like five minutes later. It's really nice, it's very chewy. It's not, you cannot compare it to rendang at all. It's overcooked. Yeah. Just a bit. But the flavor, oh. Wish you, I think you need to try this one. Yep. I think this is we'll, something you never had before. We'll wait, do wait, the wait. airplane. Oh, wow. I think it can compete with rendang. Yeah? Yeah, right? Yeah. Ooh, a little bit chewy. I need to rate, right? <laughs> what you give it? I just want to ask, what's the number? I think it's 9.5, definitely. Mm. I love this more than Rendang. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. No. Yeah. I like the sweetness. To have one more bite. The flavor is amazing. It's one of the best flavors I've had. But for me, it still cannot compete with Rendang. So it's 8.5 out of 10. For you? Oh, it's a 9, too. A 9? Yeah. The taste is so amazing. It's just yeah, a it's bit... Yeah, it's really good. It's very chewy. Last but not least, we have lalapan. Okay, so it's chicken with what's this? Crispy. Crunchy, just okay, chicken with crunchy. And then I need to I do dip it, with it like in a chili. Spicy sambal. So it looks like this. It's different than I expected it to be. There's a flavor that I don't know. I never had it before. Wait, let me try again. I'm a little bit confused to be honest. Let me see if it's the sambal or if it's the crispiness. I really like the chicken and the crispiness. Not I don't sure like the clear. sambal that much. It's Javanese sambal. I chose it actually. You did? Yeah, she asked if I want to have sambal mata, which is Balinese. I don't really like the sambal. Chicken, 9 out of 10. Sambal, 4 out of four. 10. <laughs> yeah. So it's sambal tomat. This is how it looks like. It's supposed to be like traditional Javanese sambal. Don't <laughs> spill your nose in it. Yeah, no, I don't like it. Yeah, it's like too much tomato if that makes sense. So, no. I think Lala Pan with Balinese sambal would be better. That's what I, that's what I get normally. Which no. just tried. He's used to the Balinese sambal. So what do you think? Compared to like Balinese, to be honest, I love like this more fresh than Balinese. Okay. That's what I thought. Oh. Like more, you know what I mean? Like tomato. Yeah, yeah it's like fresh. sweet a bit. like. Mm. But it's not fresher. Yeah. yeah, it's not that spicy, no. No. Not at all. Because there's so much tomato in it, I think. Yeah. So I like the whole dish is a six out of ten. So that was the last one. But I ordered one more from them. Because why not? Just the best thing ever. So the winner for me is beef rendang. And after the beef rendang, for me, the second one was the ayam curry. What was it for you? Your top two? I would say beef rendang and uh, ayam curry. Yeah. But the other beef would have been the same if it was a bit more tender. Yes. So the winners are beef rendang and the <laughs> chicken curry. I just asked the bill and we are discussing how much we think it is. To be honest, I think it will be around 280 or 290. What do you think? It's like between 230 and 250. What do you think, Vishnu? I think around 280. Yeah. Oh, okay. Let's see. I say the highest that we have bill that we have, Vishnu. I'm really curious how much it's gonna be. Oh, who wins? Vishnu wins. 138. You're the winner, Vishnu. 
183k. That's so cheap for everything we had because we ate a lot today. All right, so we just paid and now it is time to drive back home. I had such a good time trying all of this Javanese food. It was really, really nice. I love this place. And guys, thank you so much for watching. Please do not forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next adventure.